Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, well, most of you who are subscribed to me are probably subscribed to Wings, and you know he, he's been doing a lot of the challenges lately. I don't know if he's been challenging like you know his subscribers or whatnot, but he has been challenging you know himself or what the shirt Shalene. I think Shalene. <laughs> um. So I thought I would do my own challenge, and I'm actually going to, you know, with your guys' help, I want to, you know, send this to Wings. I know if I send it to him, um, he probably won't get it just for one person. But, you know, if all you guys post on the, you know, videos and stuff until he replies, I think that'd be great. Uh, so it's my challenge. I know him and Woody have that dance challenge or whatever, who's the best dancer. But my challenge is... Uh, well, if any of you have seen The Office, what season is it, Caitlin? Season one. Season one, where Michael surprises all The Office with, like, boxes of ice cream ice cream sandwiches, and, um... Nobody they, wants them. Yeah, they, nobody, nobody wants them. They all, you know, they want, like, a raise or something like that. They, they want a bonus. They don't want ice cream sandwiches. After all, they are adults, and, um... Well, without introduction, my challenge, and I know, I don't want to really, I don't want to say, you know, anything negative. I know it is, there's a lot of calories in this box, and so, if that's one thing that, because, you know, I think any of, you know, people who respect wings and people who like wings, um, you know, they want him to do well, they want to see him healthy, and they want to see him happy, and so, if that's a reason why... The, the challenge is not accepted, then that's okay. That's okay. So without further introduction, I'm gonna I'm gonna pull I'm gonna call it the Michael Scott, uh, the Michael Scott, Rubsy challenges Wings of Redemption. So the challenge is, I got the box right here. This is Market Pantry. So as Wings says, this is the <laughs> the great value stuff. Uh, you can find this at your local Target. Or uh, whatever you guys call those up there. So these are 12. Let's see. The, the 12 count. It's unopened. You know, I haven't opened it. So, uh, and since a 30 minute episode of The Office ends up being about 24 minutes without, or with commercial breaks, I'm going to go ahead and set the timer. You can see the timer probably. Here, hold on. Let me zoom in. Okay. 24 minutes. Tilt probably, it down, there's a glare. Uh, whatever, you probably can't even see it. But 24 minutes, I'm going to set it. You guys can time it. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and open the box first before I start. For the reference, I do not condone this challenge. <laughs> Alright, the box is open. I'm going to go ahead and set it out a couple. They don't need to be... I'm not... I'm going to... Part of the challenge with the ice cream sandwich is to open the wrapper. You can eat half the paper. <laughs> so, here we go. 24 minutes starting and... Whew. Three, two, one. All right. I hope this thing records for that long. Well, the thing says two, it can record for two hours. Oh, okay. These are pretty frozen, so it's not coming off on me yet. The Michael Scott challenge. And for the record, I will say one the trash by is going on the oh, plate. Yeah. <laughs> one by one. I don't want to see like the how the hot dog people do it. Like I can't even get I don't even want to do that. You'll gag. I know. So alright, here we go. You're gonna eat one of those every two minutes. That's the goal. Ooh. So for the Caitlin, why don't you talk about this weekend while I'm eating? Since I don't want to talk with my mouth open, why don't you talk about like the whole the week and the Super Bowl stuff? Mm -hmm. Well, Ryan lives pretty much downtown Indy. I mean, a walk to all the Super Bowl stuff's only like fifteen minutes, twenty minutes, nothing bad at all. Why is so funny? I'm already struggling. Oh my god. <laughs> But, so this week is Super Bowl week, and we 
today we went down with one of his friends, Seebeck, because it was his birthday, and we walked down the village and stuff like that. Then I think on Thursday, my parents are coming up, and I have a friend coming down, and we're going to do some more things. I think I'm going to do, there's like a zip line. It's like 800 some odd feet. I think I might do that because my parents signed up, and they have extra tickets. Ryan won't do it for some reason. My dad gave me those tickets. For flag football. You don't have to go to that. Deion Sanders is going to be there. Yeah, you'll probably see him from like a mile away. He's probably like on the actual field and you're probably like in the stands. But, I don't know. I think Indianapolis is a really good host city. I mean, it's one of the smaller quote-unquote capitals for the United States. But, I mean, we host the Final Four so many times. We always host big tournaments and conferences and we always do a good job. So I hope that the Super Bowl really kind of brings more light to Indianapolis. It's a good, it's not a bad city for Midwest city. I think you should have gotten water. Wash that ish down. No water. Why is that the rule? Because the water will just melt the ice cream and it's not what's it called. It's not like you need water to eat an ice cream sandwich. Doesn't the chocolate I can put half of it in my mouth and the water will just wash it down. But doesn't the chocolate make it you thirsty? Chocolate always makes me thirsty. It's part of the competition. True that. Right now Ryan's dog is just inches away. She's like peering <laughs> at these ice cream sandwiches. She can eat God, she would be so sick. We don't ever give her people food, so the day she actually tastes people food, I'm just expecting her to go crazy. Well, she's not allowed. Well, I know. That's what I'm saying. I only feed my dog when she trains, and so if I gave her, you know, people food, then she wouldn't really be... Training. Yeah, it would be like a what's it called? She'd lose it. I think I'm having a hard time. If I, rec if I get through some of these, I recommend setting them out, letting them... Fall a little Fall bit. Fall a little bit. <laughs> and he's done zero training for this. He hasn't zero. He hasn't well, practiced at all. I eat ice cream sandwiches all the time. Not all the time. Well, I mean, this past grocery trip was like the first time you'd bought some in a while. Mm -hmm. Like at least a year, probably. And you only eat one or two at a time in that setting. But, I mean, those hot dog eating competitions people train for, like, months for, and they, like, eat every day specifically for it. What do you think the world record is? For ice cream sandwiches? We should have Googled it before we did this. Maybe I'm setting it. No, I doubt that. <clears throat> it's probably, like, because there's probably, like, different ones. There's probably, like, however many in, like, a minute or however many, you know what I mean? However many total. Mm hmm I'm not a big food competition person. Gluttony is kind of disgusting. This is on a full stomach, too. The worst part about this challenge for me is Ryan was like, amped to do this, but I know as soon as he's done, like the rest of the night, I'm going to have to get, hear him complain. <laughs> he's going to complain about how much his stomach hurts and, oh, I'm so full and, oh, Caitlin, take care of me. So I think that'll be the worst part. Oh. Yeah, because he ate wings for dinner. Then snacking, he's had some beef jerky and, and like <laughs> some other kind of ice cream. I don't even know what those things are called. Um, ecla Eclairs, I think. Yeah, some kind of Eclair ice cream bar. And now he's doing this. It's like, Jesus. Woo! Oh, second one. That's wasting time. Kobe. That's wasting like 10, ten seconds. 10 seconds. You might need those 10 seconds. Well, 10 seconds times 12, that adds up. That's what I'm saying. I'll so go ahead and crumble it now then. Why do you have to crumble it, period? It's just to show that I ate it. We can see that with the video camera. They're getting softer. You should start pouring them out of the box a little bit more. That's what I did. I don't know, but you're down to one.
Well, how many is there in 12? You've done. I think it's six. At six, halfway through, if I get there, I'll go get a drink of water. Put the clock on hold? Nope. It's, oh my god. <clears throat> And technically, in this episode of Office, you don't know how many Michael eats because it's just they just show him and there's True. like a, a pile of wrappers in front of him, so you don't so, really know the content. How many do you think I'm gonna get down? You're at four. You're this on your is three. This is your third one. Are you gonna eat until you get sick? Is that your plan? Until I can't go anymore. I think you'll probably get six then. Or my time runs out. Yeah. So, how many? I just said six. <clears throat> you think the water's going to do it in for me, huh? No, I think six is a lot. I think I could only eat, like, on an empty stomach. How many of those do you think I could eat? Probably, like, four at the most. Three or four. Yeah. <clears throat> Maybe it's a good thing that your stomach's, like, digesting right now, though. It's, like, stretched out from the food before. Because a lot of times you can eat more like that instead of, like, if you don't have any food in your stomach, your stomach's too small. Should have got a camera stand. So, talk about Call of Duty when I was on tonight. You said I was raging a little bit. Yeah, so I'm filling out some applications. Four. Mine for grad school, minding my own business, and so I was like, you know, Ryan, this is <laughs> Ryan and I kind of <laughs> try and plan, like, if I have stuff to do, like homework or whatever, then he'll get on Call of Duty then, because it's convenient for both of us, out. it's a win-win, so I was like, I need to get this grad school stuff done, why don't you play Call of Duty, oh. and so he got on and I don't know what was going on. I was really paying attention to his games, but he was cussing every other second. He there was a couple times where he was hitting his chair pretty good, and he almost got up to throw things, but he restrained himself. And this is my gaming chair. Yeah, and I don't know. I think it's funny in Call of Duty because I can't really tell when he's playing. Sometimes I can't really tell what's going on in terms of like whose fault it is when he dies. Like if he made the mistake or if they player made this make but it's always funny because people will kill him and it's automatically like their fault that he's dead what yeah what's an example of that just oh he's using specialist blah 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 that's bullshit <laughs> <laughs> no that's, that yeah. doesn't make any sense how does that not make any sense you'll say they're using some stupid class or they're using like some stupid gun you will be like how's that you're like the game's bullshit you're like i got off 10 shots on that guy and didn't kill him he got off one shot on me it killed me just stuff like that where i don't know what the context is so i can't really say if he's right or wrong but it's what's funny. another example mocking me of course what do you mean of my rage Like, what do I say? I'm not going to say the things that you say because I think they're inappropriate. Well, paraphrase. You use words that are not appropriate words ever to be used. Use the first word of the, of the words. There's a lot of F's. Slander. <laughs> what kind of slander? No, I think that's a bad idea to mention. <laughs> True. Might turn off some viewers. Women, anti women slanders? Sometimes, but not really. <clears throat> I don't know. It's always awkward when he's raging because I just try and be as quiet as possible. Have you heard Heath rage? Who's Heath? The guy I've been playing with lately. The I am beating you? Mm-hmm. No, because you always have your headphones in. The other night I could have swore you heard it. Like, there are some times when you're playing and I can hear people cuss through your headphones, but I don't ever, like, you're usually playing in a group, so I don't ever know who it is. Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. There's, I hear a lot of GD. 
You can say that. God, you can say that. Yeah. I don't like the big words on the channel. So one, two, three. I'm on five and I have 12 freaking minutes and 30 seconds. I gotta get booking. I told you you're going too slow. Please don't put you. Maybe it'd be easier to take a bunch of small little bites instead of big bites. <clears throat> this is six. Oh boy. Pet your phone before it goes idle again. It's 12 minutes right now. Okay. So halfway? Yep, you're almost there. I think that water's gonna help me out though. I told you you should have had water. The hot dog competition, they get water. They like dip, <clears throat> dip the buns and ish in it. So it just slides down their throat. But that's like cheating. The, the food competition lets them use it. Yeah, I know, but like. So it's not I cheating. Would, like, if I was cheating, I'd, I'd be like, alright, I'm gonna get hot water, stuff like three of these bad boys in it, melt everything. It would still be like the quantity of it wouldn't would still exist. Like, you have a glass of water with ice cubes in it. When the ice cubes melt, you still have the same amount of water. Like, it's not going to overflow the glass all of a sudden that the ice cubes melted. So you're still putting... Yeah, but it's different. It's easier to drink things than it is to eat things. Not necessarily true. Yes, true. Gallon of milk? Okay, then. It'd be like drinking a gallon of freaking smoothie. Drink a gallon of anything. Yeah, exactly. That's what this. How many of those do you think it'll be? It'd be a ton if you put that in hot water. It'd probably expand your stomach more than eating them solid, cause all that liquid. I think those hot dog people like eat them whole. They just like let it. They open their throats and just let it slide down. Oh yeah. Mhm. Mm You need to concentrate. I think a lot of the guys want to hear you talk about that more. No, I don't think I'm good. <laughs> <clears throat> so talk about... Let's see. Number six. This is number six. One... Two, three. Stop, you're wasting time. I'm just making sure. You need to pull some more out. I know. God, this is wasting time too. No, it's not. The worst at time management. God. He's losing it. Are you looking for your jug? Mm -hmm. I have OJ over here. I don't know where your. I think your jug of water is still in your bedroom. I don't think you ever brought it out. It's okay. Eight minutes. Eight minutes and 50 seconds. <clears throat> and you have six more to go. That's like a little over a minute. Maybe they'll put me on man versus food. See, this is the thing I don't like about food challenges. It's like food is like an experience that you should enjoy. Like you should enjoy eating and like <laughs> savor it. Not like, I'm going to do something so disgusting that I make no. myself sick. Because you're not enjoying this at all. I'm enjoying every single bite. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Your face says another story. What? <laughs> My smile. You look miserable. Okay. Caitlin, you can film me so you know I don't cheat. <sighs> don't go past this wall because I won't be able to get you. Okay. Don't even think about it. Ooh. 
Told you you'd be thirsty. <sighs> Hurry, baby, you're gonna have like seven Shh. minutes. Okay. <laughs> She's just staring at those ice cream sandwiches. That's all she cares about. <laughs> what is this? Just seven? This is seven. Son of a... so that's still pretty good. You've already beaten me. Or what I said you were going to do. Did you say six? I said six. <laughs> He's going to try to make it to at least eight, because that's his lucky number. So I'm sure eight's his, like, real goal. Eight is my goal. God, I called it. Just like when you had that video challenge, lucky number. I knew it was lucky. Yeah, the, I knew the true. number was eight, <laughs> and no one was guessing it, but obviously I'm not going to cheat. But you still got the f first dual comp, so technically, like, it's like you won. But that was before you did the number challenge. Yeah. But even after, too. You still haven't done the dual comp with the other winner. That was a different story. I didn't want to talk about that right now. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan always wants me to do just a straight up commentary by myself, but I don't think I could handle that. If you guys want to see it, tell her you want to see it. I think it'd be interesting. I don't think I could handle just a straight up commentary alone. I would make her on her gameplay too. I would probably do so, Doritos Crash oh Course. Oh my god. Doritos Crash Course. She's like a, uh, what's it called? A prodigy. No. <laughs> I grew up with three girls, and I played sports, and I went outside. I never played video games as a child. I, I played sports. Yeah, but then when we weren't playing sports, well, you didn't do homework either. So I did homework when I was indoors, and he played video games when he was indoors. I can play, like, on, what were those handheld Nintendo games called? Game Boys? Yeah. I had a game, me and my sisters got Game Boys. Oh. But that was when... Play Pokemon? No. We would, oh. I played Mario a lot. But we got those for, because my grandparents used to live in Georgia. So for the long car rides, that would keep us occupied. So the my gaming experience comes <sighs> from Game Boys, and that's what about that, it. Seven? That was seven. And you got what? Like two minutes? Four minutes. Four minutes and 30 seconds. No. I don't know if I... Are you just going to quit at number eight? No. You... Oh, the rule with the water. I'm not taking any more water. So it's like you got to clean out your mouth and stuff. So that's the, that's the rule with the water. Ryan just makes up these rules as he goes. If anybody can beat me, guaranteed dual comp. I won't let you down. Somebody will be able to beat this. Guaranteed dual comp. See that could beat it. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, boy. If you're already hurting, I wouldn't push Stop. it. Stop. See, that's what I'm talking about. He rages. No. And I just try to help. Rollo. Hmm. At least he's wearing pants for this video. A lot of times he records stuff in his underwear. <laughs> <laughs> if that. Yeah. The rocking helping it digest. <laughs> Trying to bring out my Zen feel. You're not Zen. What? I said you're not Zen. Mm. 
I don't, think, I don't think it's helping. Probably not. It's probably making it slosh around. Like when I go back, it's like. Ugh. Oh, don't go back anymore. Is this eight? Standing probably is like the best. Yeah, you're eight. That I can't get you like that though. No, it feels the same as sitting like this. Okay. struggling i don't know i what do you think it is do you think it's the fullness or do you think it's the dry mouthness my mouth is fine your mouth is mm -hmm. but just the fullness are, i just think it's eating i mean are you getting the food sweats yet no because i'm cold it's making me colder uh-huh <clears throat> a minute and 30 seconds are you going to try and shove it down real I'm gonna fast? I'm going to try and get this one. Is this nine? Yeah, that's nine. Nine's a good number. Nine is a good number. Nine, nine. Minute 24. If you don't finish it, then does it count? Or will it be like eight and a half? Or will you just I got to finish it. Well, then get going. You can do it. Just put that whole thing in your mouth. You know who I want to see do this? Who? My boy Michael Morgan. <laughs> Why? Thirty seconds. <clears throat> and you saw that piece on the trash. I know. Of the whole part in your mouth. Oh God! Please don't projectile vomit on me. I think for me it'd be like the texture because the ice cream is so mushy. It'd be like gaggy. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Technically, that you ate them. He's done. He did it. Uh -huh. Nine uh -huh. ice cream sandwiches is the number to beat. Lucky point. number nine. Show all the wrappers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So how many did you... That means you only had three left or four? Three. Three in the box. That's not that bad. <clears throat> and now I can eat one of those tonight for my dessert. Yeah. Here, let me see. Okay, try and keep it far away. Uh, you know, I know when I first started, I guess you guys wanted to see, like, uh, kind of a setup video of what I have and stuff. Uh, I know it's a little dark in here right now. But, uh, it's, you know, just a tiny place, I guess. Not really anything special. I got, like, a little movie collection, I guess. I don't really watch movies. I would oh. up here so that way you're not getting the chin. Like this? Yeah. Like this that I don't really have on my computer, <laughs> um, you know, just like a 32 or 36 inch Vizio, nothing much. Xbox, PVR. I'm a UVerse man. I recommend UVerse. Uh, I got my Turtle Beaches. I don't know if you guys can see those. Let's see. Yeah, Caitlin bought that. That's another TV. See, Beck was playing. Uh, you guys can see my couch and everything like that. Say hello, Caitlin. <laughs> they haven't seen you before. I know, I've got a chair. <laughs> There's a chair. I'm in my pajamas. And Rolo. Rolo, come here. Come here. Shake. Shake. Not ice cream. Shake. 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 Good girl. Down. That's a good girl. Okay, let's see. Uh, you know, obviously the kitchen, it's a little messy right now, hopefully my mother is not seeing this, but I don't know, we'll see, it's in the fridge. You know, your usual stuff, 
There's my fave right there, pizza rolls. So if you guys want to send me any donations or anything, I do take pizza rolls. And uh, not much in the fridge, so. Alright, I guess we can head into the... My, my humble room here. Uh, obviously gotta represent... You know, my, my lids. I guess you can, you know, do that stuff. Uh, my book collection and everything. That's all Caitlin stuff. Let's see, my... Goes into my, you know, my bathroom, all that jazz. There's my bed. Uh, <laughs> um, more clothes. Another painting Caitlin did for me. I don't think I've shown for you guys. That's one of my favorites. And, uh, more clothes. You know, obviously the bathroom. I think I probably flushed the toilet. <laughs> so, um, I think that's it. I mean, nothing special. Just a, you know, a little one, one bedroom apartment, you know, that I like here. I guess I can kind of show you, uh, outside. You know, there's Indy right there. Uh, there we go. So, nothing special, but. It works for me. I guess I can give you probably a better a better view. I mean, a nice little view of the skyline, I guess. And that's going to be it. So I got 9, unfortunately. If any of you guys can do better, I promise to do a com and I will definitely fulfill my word on that. So I guess Caitlin, do you want to say bye? bye blow everybody. blow a kiss for everybody. I'm not blowing a kiss. That's leave. For me. No. For me. Oh, hello. <laughs> Alright, so guys, as always, I will see you guys next time. I hope you guys enjoy the video. So, see you later. Bye.